Hello? Check, check. Okay, let's go. Yeah, the lighting down here sucks, but I mean, I'm going to go through some of my records that are really unreal. You guys see this? Yeah, you. Talking to you. You're just climbing up on the stuff and just licking yourself. Okay, anyway, like I was saying, I'm going to go through some of my records for sale. Uh, this is a decibel uh, sampler. Let me see here. We got Red Fang, um, I Declare War, Jungle Rap, Pathology, Chest Grin, Toxic Holocaust, TUI, Ringworm, Attila, Emir, and Otep. Uh, it's pretty cheap. Like four dollars. Also, Otep put on the worst show that I think I've ever seen in my life. Or at least, like, one of them. As far as, like, as, like, a larger band goes, yeah, they were, they were fucking horrible. She was also on coke. The entire show. The Fake Boys. Some punk stuff. Uh, Rest Records. I'm not sure when this came out. Um, that artwork's pretty cool, but, I mean, I don't really like it. So, I mean, hey. Lifeless, no love for the world. This is awesome, but uh, I've got it already, I think, on OP and CD. This album kicks ass. I actually got my ass kicked when I saw them. Couldn't walk for like two days and yeah, got fucked up. Burn, uh, do or die on uh, Death Wish, I believe. Yeah, Death Wish. Pretty cool. Uh, this is a, this might be a double OP or maybe it's just gatefold, but it is still sealed. If you're into that stuff, what do you need, kitty? Uh, yeah. Check it out. Off with their heads. Another punk band. Uh, I actually just sold another off their heads LP the other day. This band's cool. I think they're from the Midwest. I don't know. Not too knowledgeable on them. Spirits. This band is pretty cool. Underrated, I feel. Not very well known, I guess, either, so that, that could be why. Sorry, that sounds dumb. But yeah, this LP is actually pretty cool. It's the layout is pretty different. It's got like, it's like, yeah, you see it comes out in the corners and stuff, yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. I own it on CD though, so I don't really need it on LP. But I mean, hey, if you do, hit me up. Damn, if I can ever get the fucking thing in there. Back in the fucking bag. God damn, whatever I'll do later. No care. A feather and bone. This is good, but I don't need it on LP because I just don't have the room. And unfortunately, it never was on CD. I mean, these guys are cool. I've seen them a couple times. Uh, in Cedar Falls, the basement, back when they had basement shows. Miles Away. This one is also good, but I don't need it on LP because. Out of space. That artwork is really sick. Came out on um, Six Feet Under records. Remembering Never. I've had a couple of copies of this. I don't really like it that much. I think, uh, oh, what the hell is the record called? Is better. Um, when Children Die First. I think that one's better than this one, but hey. Music is subjective. Ghost Key. This vinyl is actually really cool. It's clear with red splatter. I've got it, I think, in my collection. These guys are cool. Um, I saw them once in Minnesota. And uh, their bass player plays in this band of Void. I've also got records of. They're pretty cool. Six Reasons to Kill. Not really sure 
Don't really know much about that band at all. Spine. Kansas City and Chicago. This is cool. I own this too. But, yeah. Got a couple copies from John, vocalist. Can you even see me in this fucking... No, no, I need to back up there. You can probably see me now. Not like anybody really cares. I mean, whatever. Old Lines. Um, no Child Left Behind is the LP. Uh, these guys are cool. Um, they came through the area once, but I don't think I was there. My Iron Lung. This LP is pretty, I mean, it's good, but it's just kind of there. I don't know. What's up, kitty? Extinction AD. Kind of cool. He's got a good fight. Uh, yeah. I think I have two of these, actually. Maybe I sold the other one. I don't know. Breakaway. Straight Edge for us. Straight Edge Hardcore from Richmond, Virginia, I believe. Like, these guys are cool. I saw them once out in Kentucky. Bone Dance. This is fucking cool. Um, unfortunately, I never saw them. Bruise. Grief Ritual. Uh, this one's on pink. I have got the last copies that the band had on them. And, uh, okay, so it's like, I figure, you know, everybody around here is always, you know, like, bruised fucking off, which, which, I mean, yeah, they are awesome. So, I mean, I figured that these would fucking just be gone instantly, and I've had them for, like, six months, but I mean, hey. You know, whatever, I guess, well, I mean, not everybody's into, like, LPs and stuff these days, and I mean, so I guess that's just some weird mis uh, misconception that I had, that I thought that those would sell like hotcakes. But I mean, hey, they're there for whoever wants them. That's, that's what's up too, I guess. Oh, uh, I know. War Hungry. I forgot. This. Is it War Hungry? Yeah, it's War Hungry. Uh, I don't really know too much about this band. I didn't really like this. LP. So, uh, Six Feet Under release. Uh, that's some. That artwork is pretty cool. Oh, fuck me. Blackout. Also, I don't really care for it that much. Point of No Return on 1600. Tear it up. Nothing to nothing. At first, I thought that this was the... Uh. Band. Nothing to nothing, but I guess it's called Tear It Up, and they just called their LP Nothing to Nothing. Creatures. Um, these guys put out a split with Down Presser, so that's, I guess, how I know them. So I just figured I'd get the LP. I think I have this in my collection. I'm gonna get to tell them I'm just fucking stupid and I forget shit. Shy Halud. This, unfortunately, is not on... CD, so I can, so I, just, and I don't really need it on vinyl, but it's just one of those things. Uh, this is, uh, Sincerely Hated, with a couple other hate songs, I guess, that's what they have in print C. Oh, yeah, I got a couple copies of that. Will to Die. This band is sick, uh, I don't think they got got as uh, as recognized as 
they should have. Uh, so these guys in Kentucky moshed really, really hard for their set. I like this brand a lot. Twist of the Knife and that cover art is sick. I've also got this on CD as well. If you are interested. Another Bone Dance. Another Breakaway. I'm wasting your freaking time. I'm sorry. Warfare. Declaration. It's pretty cool. That artwork is cool too. This is some kind of like rock and kind of hardcore stuff on Triple B. Also got this on tape, I think. Maybe, I, maybe it's another one on tape. Stupid. Living hell. I don't know. Trip Lab machine, whatever the fuck you want. To, I don't know why the fuck he has. How long of a freaking title, but I mean, it's cool. I just can't fucking pronounce it the right. I'm always switching the laboratories and the machines and the fucking, you know, whatever the fuck. Trip machine laboratories. There you go, Chris. I got it right. It also came out on Eulogy. Under exclusive places for the Living Hell or Bolivian. Dead End Path. This band, uh, I don't know if I'm. Okay, I liked their. What song is it that I like on here? Um, Blind Faith. I like that song, and then all the other songs just. I don't know. I mean, it's cool. That artwork is also pretty fucking cool, but I just I don't need it. On, um, I don't. I just don't need it. I don't have the room. Sorry. Unrestrained. These guys did a split, I think, with Incendiary, or maybe that's a different band. I'm just fucking stupid. But yeah. Miracle Drug. That's from Kentucky. Guys, I want to say I saw them out of Kentucky. Maybe not. That was a long day. And that was a couple years ago, too. But yeah, this. How much? It's enough. LP. Sorry, I'm fucking stupid. I just got off work and I'm fucking tired, but I decided to do this. Ivy League. Hold on. Is this Bridge Night or is this 6131? No, 6131. I'm fucking stupid. Crime and Stereo, Selective Wreckage. These guys, it's like, okay, I like it. It's good, but it's just. I don't know. I just, I don't, I'm not like in love with it. It's good, and I own it on CD, I think, but I just, I don't, I don't know. Stick together. Uh, I don't know who fucking put this out. Triple B. Uh, yeah, that artwork's pretty cool. Obviously, they're a straight edge band. Slugfest. This is another one that I thought would just sell like hotcakes. What I mean, hey, whatever. This is cool. Um, I wish I had it on CD. Uh, I need it on vinyl. Safe Inside Records. Good people. Good people. Billy Raygon. Uh, these guys just split with Rational Anthem. I want to say. Yeah, Rational Anthem. I'm gonna say they're from the Midwest, I don't freaking know, but I mean, it's cool. It's good punk stuff. Great Reversal. Uh, it's on yellow vinyl. If you want that, hit me up. I've had this for, I think, a little over a year. Uh, you know, whatever. Comes with territory. Anchor. Uh, State of Mind record, of course. This is good, but I don't get it on vinyl. So I mean, I'll just find it on CD if it's on CD somewhere. 
GRG Hound. What's this on? Black. Yeah, black. Pretty cool. I mean, I don't, I mean, I don't know. I've had it for a while. <clears throat> Tone of the last two. Such a mess. This is cool. I own this as well. Um. Uh, some pop punk stuff. Forget where they're from. I mean, it's cool. Uh, yeah, that artwork is also pretty cool. Alright, the last one. So I know nobody's ever gonna fucking watch this, but, I mean, whatever. If you do, cool. Hit me up, I'll fucking give you something for free. Or whatever, maybe. Maybe. Okay, uh, this is Twin Rivals on Tilt. Also got this on tape. I think I got two of their tapes. I don't know, maybe. Uh, that artwork's cool. Some good punk hardcore stuff. I forget because I don't. I don't know. But uh, yeah, that's one of the three record crates that I've got. Uh, I just gotta get a freaking shelf and just put it all there. Just get you know. Yeah, it'll happen eventually, I guess. But hey, for now, check out the store on the big cartels, on the deep pops. See me in person. Come over. Actually, don't stay the fuck out of my house. Or I mean, yeah. Well, I mean, I guess if you're cool, you come over. But if nobody ever comes over to my house because nobody comes over to my house. But yeah, uh, see me at a show or in the area or whatever. Um, hit me up on Instagram if you're on Instagram or Facebook I'm all over the Facebook or the Twitter fuck Twitter um or the where else am I text me if you got my number I hope you don't have my number that's about it I'm gonna go to bed and m maybe upload this in the next year but probably not cause I still have like 10, of, 10 other ones to upload so Guess I'm just doing this just to have it and just I don't know. None of this makes sense. Go fuck yourself. Um I'm just kidding. Or am I? No, I don't think I'm kidding. Goodbye.